Welcome back to my channel. My name is Hooja and today we are doing these cute little passion twists together. And I'm going to show you guys how to do passion twists. This is going to be a how to. I will be showing you step by step how to install these cute vacay ready year round ready passion twists. Like I'm excited for you guys to see this because it's bomb. Let's just get into the tutorial and um, let's get into it. Honestly, I feel like it's not going to be that hard. It's just going to be more so tedious, like every other style that you do yourself. Oh, so my hair is halfway done. All I did was actually do the parts. Shout out to my mama because she did them for me. I had a really rough day today. So she definitely took care of your girl because she fully parted the back for me. And now I could just do what I got to do and just do the front. But I wanted to do these passion twists for a vacation. I feel like they are vacation chef's kiss. The back is fully parted like I said. So yeah, it's fully parted. I hope y'all can see. Um, I have about four rows in my hair. Yesterday I did my whole prep routine for protective styling and I stretched my hair and I did like the low tension heat method to get my hair a little bit longer, like a little bit lengthier. But I will show you guys all of my supplies. Bought the model model. Honestly, I could have bought free choice, but they didn't have it at my store. They did have free choice, but they didn't have the uh, length that I wanted. I only saw 14. So if you're doing this style, just be careful. If you want it a little longer, definitely look at the pack to see if the inches are correct. So I got the 22 inch new waterway from Model Model and it looked really great. So I'm like, let me try it out. This is color number two. This is how long it is. You will need all your supplies like your shining jam or any type of jam. You can use like a rat tail comb for parting. You can use clips, scrunchies to keep your hair intact. Don't forget your hair. You will need a crochet needle. You also will need some rubber bands. And then I'm also using some hair food because I need this hair to be taken care of and look good, okay? And then I also have some avocado oil. This is the Via Natural. And that's about it. I would love for my protective style to have a middle part. It is a lot easier to see your parts when they are gelled down. So I'm just starting at my ear. And you can also take out your baby hair. That way it's not getting in the mix. I'm going to brush that section all together. Just making sure that all of it is coated. And honestly, it doesn't need to be super, super tight and you don't want any hair loss. And you can even oil your bands before you put them in your head. Open the latch, put the hair on, close that latch and pull it through. And what's been helping me, I do it either two ways. I either make like a big hole and I just pull it through. Pull it all through. And then make a knot. I feel like this was a little bit easier for security. You feel me? And then just kind of pull that tight. So it might be some tension on your head. Um, if not, don't pull it super, super tight. And then I'm just prepping my hair. And then I just start off as a braid. It just felt easier and it felt more secure. I don't know what happened, but it definitely felt more secure. And the rubber band is hiding itself. So I just start off with a braid maybe like half an inch down. That might be a little bit more than that. And then I just start to twist. So I'm gonna split. I'm gonna split my two pieces of hair. And then I'm going to start twisting. 
so just kind of rotating my hands together and you kind of want to follow the way your hair is curling the way that you put in the hair is the way that you need to twist because then it won't twist correctly it's super easy and my hair is pretty long so I do have to twist super super hard but I am also dipping my hands into my conditioning gel and just keeping that moisture and that frizziness out the way so once you get to the bottom you can either like cut it curl it whatever you want to do I'm just gonna curl it just fling that little girl back there but yeah that's basically it I will show you guys how to do one more pull it through make that big loop for yourself and just pull all the hair through I find that this is the easiest way I'm just going to bring this back to the middle separate my two pieces and then start twisting putting product on my hand and twisting with the curl not against it and that is it and then you just want to be super super firm that is it so excited to be cute i have about 32 passion twists in my head super super cute nice and neat they're so fresh they're just like sticking up and stuff whatever but super super cute I didn't know how I was going to feel about this style, but it turned out very nice. I am going to oil my scalp. I have my avocado oil from Via Natural. And look, my scalp is just feeling real good. So I am going to be taking my lot of body. And this is the foaming mousse. So I'm just going to place this in my parts and all over just to kind of set everything. I like doing this step. I usually do it like off camera. I never really do it on camera. But just to like set the entire style. And it does go away, it does dry, so don't worry about like residue. This is the finished style, period. I have 32 in my head right now. It doesn't seem like a lot, but it's actually because it's super, super sleek right now. I'm definitely gonna show you guys what it looks like a few days after I'll insert like pictures and stuff. So you guys will see like the full effect because it does get bigger over time passion twists are the perfect vacation hair i don't know i can't decide what style is gonna like be that one for me like this is super super cute but i just feel like i don't know i think because it's fresh it's not hidden but it's gonna hit when i take these pictures my final thoughts i like this style it was super easy and fast i did it in a couple hours and i look cute i'm feeling myself so i want you guys to feel yourselves too thank you guys for watching i will see you guys in the next video in the darkest hour i want to come for you Oh, where do we go?